Rav, you repeated several times, uh, you, you mentioned that we mostly influence the world through the inner conduits. Yes, because more and more we're coming to a state where we can implement this. That's why I'm talking about it. Before that, we talked about how many articles we're spreading out, how many clips, etc. In truth, that won't benefit. That's for the time being. It's also so that we will engage in it. But the main thing is our action in the connection between us. That defines everything. The change comes from there. So how can we begin to feel that our work in connection is really sending such a... You won't feel it because here, although you can feel externally somewhat, but understand that these things need to be more in faith above reason. And we need to believe to the faith of the sages, of our wise, that this is how it is, that we're in the concealed nature and we need to operate according to the concealed laws that are concealed from us, but we can uh, activate them, we can operate them. And that should be added to our prayer during the lesson to... In everything that you can. Altogether, we're doing this, we don't have anything but unity. Except for unity, we don't have anything. That's why we need to think about the influence of the unity to the extent in which it's obligated, both according to the external form that we see in the world, also according to our obligation towards everyone, towards the nations of the world, towards the people of Israel, towards the tribes that are somewhere out there. It all depends on the connection between us. Okay, and uh, yes. from the other side of it, we say many times that today we're approaching the last generation, the generation of the general correction. So our influence, our inner influence on the world, it should also ultimately manifest materially. I mean, the Kabbalists should become uh, the educators of humanity in practice. Or in practice, it's through the internal point of connection between us. We need to understand that the upper light cannot expand towards humanity, in whether it's through the extent, unless it's through the extent that they're in great torments, and then in a very little way he can illuminate to them without clothing to them as a surrounding light. But that's through the path of suffering. Or that we, because we are included in, in humanity and belong to humanity also, if we connect, then we become a true source of light that spreads in a nice and right way towards the kilim that are corrected and he fills in this world. Otherwise, this responsibility, this importance must be Truly, we need to feel it, to understand it, and not to think that we're so small and despicable. We'll feel ourselves much more damaged, hurt, much more, because anyone who's greater than his friend, his inclination is greater than him. And we will feel how, when we advance in spirituality, it becomes a greater rag and that shouldn't stop us to feel each time the importance and uniqueness. 